to do one year, a one year or their first year of their degree program here in India. And then move on to complete their second year and third year program in Australia. So there's significant benefits for young people uh, to go through the ABP program. One of the first benefits that I find is that up to 12th, 12th class, many parents are confused. They want to send their children abroad, but it is very expensive, and they know that their children may, may be not so mature. They don't know how to roll roti for themselves. They don't know how to cook dal. They don't know how to clean because they're being looked after by their parents. So the abroad program allows what we do is we allow young people to undertake an Australian education, but nothing changes about their family. Nothing changes about their um, their cooking habits, their eating habits, everything else stays the same. So it is not a big shock to, to young people and to their parents when all of a sudden they've gone to a different country such as Australia or Canada or UK or USA. So what we do is we take young people into our program and from the very first day, we take their hand and it's like uh, swimming. If you've never learned how to swim, we'll put you in the pool. We'll start teaching you about Australia. We'll start teaching you about Australian education in business, in IT, in accounting. And the program, over the course of one year, takes their hand and walks them step by step by step. So that at the end of one year, they've learned all about Australia, they've learned the first year of their degree program here in India, and they've also learned how to start looking after themselves. So that when they go to Australia, they're far more, uh, how do I say, prepared. They're prepared and ready to take on the challenges of Australian education, to take on the challenges of Australian work, and they're ready uh, to be successful students. We've, we've sent, uh, well, in the last year, we've had a 99% grant rate, visa grant rate of our students. And our AEPP students in Australia are regarded as one of the best, uh, as clearly distinguishable, as, as a, the best prepared students in, uh, amongst all of our other students. So there's great success that we've already achieved with the Abroad Unified Pathway Program. Um, now we're very pleased to bring this particular program to Guwahati. We are currently across 40 uh, other cities across India, all the way from um, Ahmedabad, Surat, down to um, uh, Cochin, um, across to Indore, uh, and I'm sure Piyush will tell you a lot more about the actual program in a few moments during his, program, during his presentation. But we're right across India. We have a large number of centres. We have proven success record, a track record of success in educating young people here in the first year of their degree, and then preparing those students, and then arranging their visa, and then taking them to Australia. So this is a fantastic program that we invite young people here in Assam in Guwahati and throughout the North East to consider to join us here in the um, centre um, through Aryan's Education who will support you just in the same way as our other centres across India 
and we expect that there'll be uh, a good number of students who will um, come from this centre and go to Australia and be successful uh, graduates in Australia. So the um, program that will be delivered in Australia uh, is we have a Bachelor's of Business and a Bachelor's of Information and Communication Technology. Those programs are accredited by our Australian industry bodies. So the Australian Computer Society fully accredits the Bachelor's of Information Communication Technology and the uh, Association for Certified Practicing Accountants certifies our Bachelor's of Business Accounting. So both programs will provide high level of industry recognition at the completion of their qualification. We also provide, the Australian Government provides a two-year post-study work visa at the completion of the two-year degree, or the two years in Australia. So they'll do one year in India, they'll do two years during their course in Australia at either Melbourne or Sydney, and then Following that, they'll do two years in the post-study work with their post-study work visa, where they have the opportunity to work full time, and uh, and that will give them much needed work experience in the, in particular an Australian company. So in conclusion, I'll just say uh, thank you for having me here to present the Abroad Unified Pathway Program. There are many, many benefits to young people uh, from an international education. They learn emotional intelligence and soft skills and adaptability. And these skills are going to make all the difference in addition to their course uh, to their job prospects in the future. And so again, thank you for having me here. I look forward to um, the success of this particular program and uh, we'll, I'll, I'll leave it at that. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Mr. Jason. Uh, it was a nice by you. Now I'd like to invite uh, uh, Mr. Hughes Pandey, who is a business development manager of the EMTB. Uh, Mr. Pandey, please come. A very good afternoon to all of you. So I'd like to start uh, with a presentation about the EMTB, which will answer any doubts which you might have in your mind. So this is our education group hierarchy. We have ATMC education group at the top. Then we have got AUBP, which is the pathway to ATMC in Australia. Through ATMC in Australia, we can go to USC, the University of Sunshine Coast. We have got Federation University with us, and we have got Baxter School, which is our vocational training institute in Australia.
So in this video, uh, video, we try to give you a gist about what the program is and how it supports the students. So our concept is simple. We study first year in Assignment and complete the remaining two years of the Australian degree in Australia in the universities and colleges over there. So this is the concept. First year of pathway program in Guwahati. Remaining two years of bachelor's degree either in Australia or in New Zealand. If you go to Australia, you will get a two years post-study work visa. And if you are going to New Zealand, the student will get a three years post-study work visa. So it's a unique pathway for the international launch of the students. It's a very unique skill transfer program where we transfer 100% of the credit which the student have earned in the first year. We have got associations with some of the top ranked universities in Australia. And the students get a head start by initially knowing what they have to study in Australia by studying first year in India. The students uh, save uh, huge in terms of financials when we say, because in Australia if they go directly for three years, they will be uh, like investing something around 35 lakh rupees. But when they go through a UPP, they will be saving around 15 lakh rupees and they can complete the program in around 20 lakh rupees. How we are different from others? If a student is going through AUPP, uh, we are giving them time saving, we are giving them cost saving. The passport preparation and the IS examination is done along with the first year in India. The university is selected alongside the program and the admission and the visa process is done simultaneously. So the student don't have to go to uh, various agents for their visas and university selection. And to know from the first day itself where they are going and what they will be studying. These are the courses we are offering in Australia. We have got Bachelor of Information and Communication Technology. We have got Bachelor of Information Technology. We have got Bachelor of Business. We have got Bachelor of Commerce Accounting. And we have got Bachelor of Accounting. This is the uh, IT structure that what the students will study in India in the first year. So over there, if you will see, there are very uh, selected modules which we have done, like building a dynamic website, uh, designing a database, using Office structure, query language, ICT data conversion. So these kind of modules are not taught to the students for studying in India. But it's very important for them to learn them so that they can be successful ahead. Similarly, when I talk about business, so these are the 10 modules which they will study in the first year. This is the entry requirement of an AUPP student. So if the student is from a CPSC or an ICSC board, they should have a minimum of 50% marks in their 12th. If they are from a state board, they need to have a minimum of 55%. An open board student need to have minimum of 60%. When you compare these uh, percentage with the direct students who want to go directly, so we have a rebate of 10%. A direct student need to have 60% from ICSC board, 65% from state board, and 70% from open board. When I talk about IELTS, so for an AUPP student, IELTS is not an immediate requirement. They can enroll to their international degree program without IELTS also. And when they go in the second year, they have got one year time to get their required scores in IELTS. Similarly, passport is not an immediate requirement for an AUPP student when compared with a direct student. And funds also, if you want to go directly, you need to have the funds in your accounts. Otherwise, you will not get the visa. But for AUPP, for the first year, we don't need the immediate funds. And we have got one year time to prepare for the funds also. These are some of our affiliations from our universities and the colleges. This is the certificate provided by ATMC to AUPP students where they have mentioned that uh, the students are eligible to study second and third year degree in Australia. Second, uh, similarly, this is the Federation University Certificate authorizing AUPP students to the University of Sunshine Coast authorization certificates. These are some of our associations in India with the top of uh, colleges and universities. So we have got Asma Group which is in Punjab, Pyramid College is in Punjab, GTM is in Chennai, Lakshmi Global Education is in Chennai, Karnal Education is in Haryana, Atanal Education a University is in Himachal, and DSGMC is in Delhi. So these are our partners and they are running our program in the campuses. This is a map of our uh, presence and centers all over India. So we have covered mostly the entire part of India and now we are coming to Goa. The benefits of AUPP are mentioned below. Uh, there is huge cost saving where the student can save up to 14 lakh rupees. The students become graduate from the best universities of the world 
and it's a very unique pathway where they study 10 months in India and they complete the degrees by studying 2 years in Australia. They save a uh, very important first year of their uh, education and they don't have to waste it just to prepare for the IELTS or for the passport. We give complete visa assistance and guidance through, uh, to the students through our recognized channels. And we have got support services like airport pickups, accommodation, job placement assistance, and personal counseling in Australia, which a direct agent will never give to a student. This is our diploma and a UPP certificate samples, which we provide to the students after completion of the first year course in India. These are the job outcomes in Australia after studying the business program and the IT program. So they have an option to uh, be hired for project manager, program consultant, sales executive, product managers, project engineers, system managers, app developers, etc. This happens when the student goes to Australia, what ATMC is doing for them. First of all, we are providing them airport pickup support in Australia. This is some of the real pictures of our accommodation which we are providing to our students in Australia. So we make sure that the students are well settled in Australia and they are completely free at home before they start studying over there. So we say that AUPP is a short pathway to the first international degree of a student which leads to their first international job. And now we hope that Assam will also participate with us and the students will benefit of this AUPP program in Guwahati. That's all from my side. If you have any questions, we are open for it also. Thank you.